Hey YouTube, welcome back. This week I was up on Metcalf Road in San Jose and decided to use Tesla's FSD feature on the last part of my journey to see how it could handle such a beautiful mountain road. I'm currently on version 10.11.2 and with that, let's dive in. So we have some vehicles in front of us, so the car is going to be slowing down and not going actual road speed, so it should hopefully be pretty good here. It's blatantly cut in this lane line. Oh, shit. Oh, wow. That was okay. I was not expecting that whatsoever. Uh, not okay, FSD. Let's see if I can get to reactivate here at some point. Doesn't want to reactivate after that, which is very interesting. Eventually, I was able to re-engage FSD. The system, unfortunately, wasn't performing as one would hope, so I decided to film the bottom section only. I can post a full road video once I trust the system more in this environment. So it is successfully coming to a slowdown, but I believe that's mostly just for the trucks in front of us. And I heard it's blatantly going on the wrong side of the road, telling me to take over immediately. I am. And now it's turned itself off. So I'm going to turn it back on. Once again, we're cutting the road lane. It wants me to take over. And, oh God. We'll reactivate. How is this safe to be in the hands of customers? That's what I want to know, especially if they pay $12,000. Why would you pay $12,000 for this? Thank you for tuning in to this week's short FSD video. As the system progresses, I'll film longer stretches of this beautiful road. As you saw, it did not perform the best, and that was only the last of the bottom section of this road. However, in the meantime, check out the sneak peek of our next video. Feel free to subscribe so you don't miss out when it drops. Oh, fuck. It didn't do anything. It just destroyed my $5 bucket.